Hi guys and welcome to my channel. My name is Mariella and my channel is Mariella's This and That. Hey, if you would like, subscribe, bring the notification bell, comment and share my video. I would appreciate it a lot. Also, you can become a member of my channel by just clicking the join button or you can give a super thanks and I would appreciate that too, but it's all up to you. Today we are going to make grilled chicken pasta salad. So come on, let's get started. Okay, over here I got a pan of water that I'm bringing up to boil. To that pan of water I'm going to add one chicken bouillon. And that way it will flavor my pasta with the chicken flavor. Then I'm going to turn my grill on about 400. I have two chicken breasts in here that I'm going to salt and pepper. That's the only seasoning I'm putting on my chicken. And you want to season both sides of your chicken. I love this grill. It don't take it long to get hot. Unlike an outside grill, it takes forever. And because these are thin, it won't take them long to cook. Now because I'm just making this for me, I'm using about 8 ounces of garden rigatoni, which is the tricolor rigatoni. I like this pasta for making pasta salad because I like the collars.
It's smelling good in here already with the chicken cooking. Y'all, I need to stop watching YouTube channels. I need to. I need to just stop. Last week, it was the tornadoes in Oklahoma and Nebraska and um, Iowa or Idaho. This week, it's flooding in Texas. My water is almost to a boil. Now I'm going to make the dressing to go on top of it. This is a good season Italian blend salad dressing. And what I do to make this, I just pour the packet in here, and then I use about a fourth of a cup of olive oil, about an eighth of a cup of vinegar, and about two 
tablespoons of lemon juice, and then I just shake it up. And there you have it. That's the dressing for our pasta salad. Oh yeah. But we're going to boil this pasta probably about 12 minutes. And then when we drain it, we'll run it under cold water to stop the cooking. So I will bring you guys back when we're ready for the next step. Okay, guys, we are back. The chicken's done. It's been sitting here resting. My noodles are over here draining so now what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna dice up my chicken And see, it's been sitting here cooling off enough that I can touch it with my fingers. Excuse me. In our bowl, we're going to add our pasta. Then in this bowl, I have some yellow bell pepper, the green tops of a green onion, and some onion. So I'm going to add that in here. Then we're going to add our chicken. And I want all them juices in there. That's flavor. Bring this closer. Now I have some chopped up bacon. Me and Buddy had bacon this morning, so I went ahead and took the whole pack and chopped some up. And then I have some mini pepperonis.
and I got some cheese. Hold on. I'm going to use what's left, which ain't much, of this Kobe Jack. And then I have some Fiesta blend that I'm also going to use. And you use however much cheese you want. If you like cheese, use a lot. If you like don't like cheese, then you just use a little. Shake my dressing back up. I used about half. And then I'll stir that around and see how much more we need. Okay, guys, sorry about that. I don't know when exactly my phone stopped recording, but I want to thank you all for watching. If you would, like, subscribe, ring the notification bell, leave a comment, and share my video. If you want, you can join the channel, and also you can send a super thanks. And by the way, the pasta salad is the bomb. Because while I was trying to clear up some storage, I finished eating it. So it was really good. The recipe for the pasta salad will be in the description below. And remember, don't let anybody steal your sunshine or take your smile. Have a good weekend, guys. Bye-bye.